What is up, everybody? I hope you're having an amazing day. Um, the Lord uh, has been speaking to me lately really powerfully about the power of God, seeking after pursuing a fresh Pentecost, a new Pentecostal movement. Um, I, I really feel like the Lord is saying something right now about uh, Azusa Street and going after another wave of Pentecostal power. And uh, I had a dream last night. I didn't actually even realize that <coughs> yesterday was the 116th anniversary of the Azusa outpouring. Um, but I had a dream last night that just shook me. I was, I can't tell you everything about it, but um, I'll tell you some of it that I think I'm allowed to tell. Um, but uh, in the dream, Love Revival, the ministry that I lead, was uh, starting a new church campus. Um, and there was, uh, there was three offices and I knew that represented our three current campuses in West Virginia, Romney and Martinsburg, and then Virginia front Royal. But in the dream, I knew we were starting a new one and Lord told me where I can't tell you yet, but Lord told me where. And, um, I started preaching. I watched myself preach. And in the dream, it was like I watched myself preach like a full like 30 minute message or something. I watched myself preach this message and I was talking about how to have Pentecostal uh, results. We need a fresh baptism of fire. We need a new Azusa movement. And um, in, the, in the dream, I was talking about how nearly a billion souls have been saved since Azusa Street that have been directly related uh, or can, can trace their spiritual heritage to the Azusa outpouring and um, that, you know, there was, you know, tens of thousands, hundreds of thousands, maybe, I don't know, of churches that have been planted in China and Brazil and America in the last 116 years uh, that have led, you know, millions and millions and millions of people to Jesus that had uh, direct, um, you know, uh, experience due to the Azusa outpouring. And, I, and I'm one of those people. We are all you speak in tongues, you are a, a son or a daughter of Azusa, um, uh, ultimately the Lord, but you know what I mean? So, ooh, um, anyway, so yeah, I'm excited. I think God's doing something new. I think he's doing something fresh. There's a fresh, uh, outpouring of the Holy spirit and, uh, it's time, it's time for another wave of revival. I really sense that this next wave of the move of God is going to be marked by planting churches. Um, I, I've had a word for years that the John Wimber uh, anointing, gifting, John, John was, you know, people may have known him as a pastor, but John Wimber was an apostle and he had a, a, a breakthrough uh, anointing and gifting on his life to plant churches in the vineyard movement. And I, I feel like that's coming back. I believe that as we uh, get more and more people filled with the Holy Ghost, we're going to plant more and more churches and um, it's going to be, it's going to be powerful. So anyway, God bless you. Get hungry for more and, uh, let's see another great outpouring.